Hey guys, it's Dolly Deja here. Welcome to my Kirby plushie tutorial. This tutorial is a beginner project. You must know the basics of crochet and amigurumi before starting. I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial and leave any questions in the comments and ways to improve my tutorials. Thank you. I also forgot to mention that this pattern is crocheted in the round, so you will need a stitch marker. Okay, now we're gonna start with Kirby's body in the color pink, or you can choose a different color. So first we're gonna start off with a magic circle and I can link a tutorial for that in the description. Now we're gonna do six single crochets in the magic circle. And then we're going to pull the circle closed. Careful with the plush yarn, it might snap. For round two, we're going to increase in each stitch, which is two single crochets in one stitch. So, one. And then in the same stitch, two. And then you're going to increase all around. an increase, another increase, and then you're going to increase all around. For round three, we're going to single crochet increase. So on the first stitch, single crochet, stitch marker in, and then increase, and then we're going to repeat that all around. So single crochet, increase, and then repeat. For round four, we're going to do two single crochets and then an increase. So on the first stitch, single crochet, and another single crochet, so one, two, increase, and then we're going to repeat that again. One single crochet, two single crochet, and then increase. And then we're going to repeat that. Okay, for round five, we're going to do three single crochets and then one increase. So one single crochet in the first stitch. Two. Three. And then increase. Then one, two, three, increase. And then we are going to repeat that all around till we reach the end. Okay, for round six, we are going to just single crochet all around the round. So we're just going to single crochet around. Okay, for round seven, this is the round where we make the, the hands of Kirby. So we're gonna do eight single crochets, a bobble stitch, 12 single crochets, another bobble stitch, and then just single crochet the rest of the way. So and then I'm gonna show you guys how to do the bobble stitch. So first we're gonna do eight single crochets. Seven, 
eight. And now I'm gonna show you guys this bobble stitch. Okay. So for the bobble stitch, it's basically incomplete double crochets. So we're gonna yarn over, enter your hook in the next stitch, pull through, insert through two loops, yarn over this, pull through two loops. Then we're gonna keep going until we have six loops in total. So we're gonna do that five times. Through. Make sure to pay closely attention when you do the. All right, so we have six loops on our hook in total. So now we're gonna yarn over and then pull through all six loops very slowly, and then that is our bobble stitch. And then now we're going to do 12 single crochets and then another bobble stitch and I'll show you guys that again. So one, and when you're going into the next stitch, make sure you're, you're going to you scoop the bobble over so you can see the next stitch. So we're going to do one and then pop that bobble out, two, three, four, five, So now we're going to start our other bobble stitch. So I'm going to yarn over, go on the next stitch, pull through, go through two loops. Oops. Sorry about that. Yarn over, go through, pull through, two loops. And then we're going to do that five times until it's six loops on our hook. So it's basically a double crochet. But it's incomplete. Alright, we have six loops on our hook. I'm gonna yarn over and then pull through all of those and then scoot it over. Find the next stitch and then single crochet in the next stitch. Pop it through and then just single crochet rest it away for this round. For rounds eight and nine, we're just gonna single crochet around. So round eight, we're just gonna single crochet around. And then round nine, we're just gonna single crochet around for basically two rows. So we just do that. And then I will meet you guys at round 10. Okay, for round 10, we're gonna do three single crochets and a decrease, and the decreases I use are the invisible decreases, so I'm gonna show you guys that. So one single crochet, two, three, and then a decrease, so you go in the first loop of the next stitch, the front loop of the next stitch, and then a front loop of the next stitch as well. And then just swing through and then do. So that's how I do my invisible decreases. So one, two, three, and then invisible decrease front loop, the next stitch, front loop of the next next stitch. Yarn under and then I'll show you guys that if you guys don't understand that. One two, three, and then invisible decrease, front loop, next stitch, front loop of another next stitch, through, and alright, and then we're going to repeat that all around. Okay, for round 11, we're going to do two single crochets and a decrease, so one, two, Decrease again. And then we're just going to repeat this all around. Okay, for round 12, we're going to do one single crochet and then a decrease. 
And before we keep closing it more and more, we're going to stop here and stuff really quickly before this, the hole gets too small. So you can use any stuffing you like. So now we're going to continue with the single crochet and the increase and then you can stuff as you go. Okay, and now we're done with the body. So here we're going to close the hole. The way I do it is I go in and out of the front loops and then just pull as it closes. And then I just start weaving my ends in and then the body's all done. And then here's the body. So now we're gonna get started on the feet. All right, let's get started on the feet. So for the feet, we're gonna use red yarn or you can choose another color. And we're gonna do a magic circle of four single crochets. So first we're gonna do a magic circle. And then we're gonna try four single crochets in the magic circle. the circle and then all we do is increase in each stitch for the next round so we just increase around and then that's one foot done so basically all we do is just the four single crochets in a magic circle and then increase all around and then that's one foot and then we're going to leave a slightly long tail so we can sew it on and then we're going to finish that off and then we can cut that middle part and just tuck it in and then we're going to make one more of these Okay, now we're gonna start the assembly. So first we're gonna sew the feet onto the bottom of the body. So make sure your hands are facing the right way. So this is the back, cause the hands are further. This is the front, the hands are like closer. And then you basically just sit the body down. You know how Kirby sits. And you just put the feet down. There's not really an area where you put them, just, just reference right here. His feet is just like that. So you just set him down and then just put his feet on the side. And then to keep the place, I use sewing uh, knitting needles or you can use long sewing needles. Don't know where mine are. You can use long sewing needles. And I'm just gonna sew his feet on. And then you're going to repeat this for the second foot.
Okay, for Kirby's face, I'm using square filts in the color black, light pink, white, and blue. And while you're cutting out your shapes, you can start getting your hot gun, hot gun ready. For Kirby's face, this is everything I cut out. I cut out two small white ovals, two half ovals of blue, two black ovals, one black circle, and then two pink ovals. It takes up two stitches, one, two of his face. First you're going to glue the white on top of the black. And then you're going to glue the two blue half ovals at the bottom. So after we have the eyes glued, we're going to sit the eyes six rows down, two stitches apart. So one, two, three, four, five, six. like around that area and then two stitches apart like this Thank you guys so much for watching my Kirby tutorial video. And if you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure you like and leave a nice comment. And make sure you subscribe if you want more free patterns. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye! Okay. And now, your Kirby is all finished. And make sure you unplug your hot glue gun. And now, you finished the Kirby. And these are perfect for... Ow! Okay, y'all. It's funny how we were just talking about not burning yourself and my arm just touched the hot glue gun. Okay, so I will cut that out, but I'm going to keep that in just so y'all know. Don't burn yourself like I did.